so I'm here making another video today because I was saying earlier that I found my tripod and I'm really excited because maybe I can start to do some nail stuff and I don't know if you noticed before in my previous video how I kind of just had one little white stripe on my nail on this hand I think and I don't know it's because my nails are getting kind of long, and sometimes it gets kind of boring to just do one color, but I don't know, I had on this nail polish earlier, and um, I had it, you know, it was just plain for a while, because I thought it was really pretty, it has all these little shimmers in it, you know, but then it was starting to get all messed up, because I did it at night, and I have this bad habit of doing my, ha my hands, my nails at night and then just going to sleep on it and getting like finger imprints in it and then it annoys me and when it starts chipping forget about it so yeah so anyway it was starting to get messed up anyway so I decided to take this little my little white nail polish and do a stripe and I was like hmm I like how that looks so anyway I was thinking alright I might start doing stuff like doing my nails on camera and I started messing around with this little like rhinestone look and then I was like darn it like I should have started taping it and like just to test it and stuff but I didn't <laughs> so I remember when I'm like done with one hand I haven't done this hand yet and then I was I don't know what I'm saying uh, I can't speak English right now but anyway I think I was watching last week like one of Dulce Candy 87's videos and she had this really pretty red nail polish it was like I don't know kinda almost the same color as my camera but you can't see my camera duh <laughs> but anyway and she had like these little tiny like rhinestones all along it and a little French manicure kind of with that like with a white at the tip I thought somebody was at my door anyway so I thought it was really cute and really classy and then also, many, many weeks ago, was I watching, I think it was Julie G713, had a video on, like, how to apply rhinestones to nails, and I was like, hmm. And then, lucky me, when I was cleaning again, I found this old manicure set that I think my godmother gave me for one of my birthdays, because even when I was in, like, sixth grade, I would do my own nails, and I would use fake nails and stuff. And yeah, and I had these little rhinestones, these little nail jewels, so, yeah, so I don't know if you noticed my middle finger is plain, and honestly, that's because when I was doing it, I dropped one, <laughs> so I said, let me just um, pretend that I did that on purpose, and say that it's my own little creative flair, you know, have it kind of still symmetrical, because there's 10 of these little things in the strip yeah so I don't know I'm gonna do my other hands now and hopefully I don't mess it up when I go to sleep cause that always happens and it's almost 10 o'clock already but I mean I don't know I'm gonna be up for a while but the polish takes a while to dry and even when it's dry on surface it still like can get smushy smudges and everything so I don't know Alright, so, if anybody's watching out there, I've probably already bored you to tears. <laughs> but, yeah, I don't know if anyone would actually be interested in, you know, doing something like this, or um, if I should do a little bit more. I think this is really plain and simple, but, yeah. I don't know, I might do some more later to entertain myself. 